my role in the fire service is in community safety. Um, I'm the business development officer. And my role is to um, liaise with partner agencies um, to create different intervention schemes within the community to support the vulnerable people um, and also to give development opportunities to those um, who need confidence boost and to realise their potential as well. So our fire cadet programme is run at six locations around the county um, and is for young people aged 13 to 17. The idea of fire cadets isn't necessarily just to learn how to be a firefighter, it's to learn all of those different skills that come with learning those operational skills. Um, that might be just teamwork, communication, self-esteem, um, learning how to interact with others, and also as part of that they get their Duke of Edinburgh Award as well. The Young Essex Assembly is the elected youth council for Essex. So it mirrors the county councillors, so there is 75 elected YEA members for Essex as there are 75 elected councillors across the county. It's been a real opportunity for them to be able to input um, their thoughts and also to gain a better understanding and learn about how the police and the fire commissioners work. I think they're going to particularly remember the virtual headsets, they're going to understand um, a lot more about driver safety and about the impact it has on themselves and other people around them if they are potentially caught up in a car accident um, and I think that they will be able to um, share that information with their peers, family and friends which I think is really positive. Today we got to have a go with the hoses and we got to learn how each of it works and what different pressures there are and we also got to shoot some of the buildings and try and get as high up as we could. We did a question and answer session with the cadets and they were telling us about what they do, what they go up to and how it works and then we've been learning about the rest of the fire service and the different roles and stuff. The best bit of the morning for me has probably been getting to hold the hoses because it really works on our teamwork skills and also our communication. There's a lot of things that I didn't know. I didn't really know much about it to start with. Um, I learned about there's so many different roles, not actual like operational stuff. Like, there's pastoral stuff and um, lots of different management roles in the fire service. There isn't really a fire cadets where I live, so we got to learn a lot more about what they did and all their roles. You get a car accident, I never really thought about that, that's part of the fire service as well. When I first came here I didn't have any idea of what I really wanted to do and I didn't really think about going into the fire service. This has definitely made me consider maybe doing it. Today's been absolutely fantastic. It was really good to be able to come in and talk to uh, the guys and girls here today about the Fire and Rescue Service in Essex. Uh, I found it really interesting that they have actually chosen to come in and hear about the Fire and Rescue Service itself. Uh, and it's really positive that young people are taking such a real bright interest in what we do, how we're doing things, and especially around how we are moving forward in the future uh, around how the Fire and Rescue Service is evolving as a service. The questions are amazing, they've really articulated well, they've very well thought out, some very challenging questions for me as an individual to answer. It's also given me a new perspective of understanding how old I am, because sometimes I was talking about things and actually realising these individuals were a lot, uh, weren't even born about some of the times and the experiences that I've had. So for me it's about a reality check as well, and it was also about understanding how uh, people today um, teenagers today are thinking around the Fire and Rescue Service and the direction that we need to take in the future to be able to attract young people into the fire service and make them safer, more responsible human beings out in the communities in which we serve, especially in Essex. It's vitally important the people of Essex get involved in the Fire and Rescue Plan that the PFCC and Essex County Fire and Rescue Service has set. We really want to hear what the public think. We really want to hear people from all different backgrounds what they think about us as a service. We need to tailor the service for the future to respond to the community, to be able to not only respond but also to prevent and protect our communities and ensure that we have a fire rescue service fit for the future.